again to knock off number 21, Missouri. And out in right field, a diving catch by Bree Payne. Emmanuel, that sack fly, drove in her 28th run of the year. Oh, what a play by Invergo at second. That took a base hit away from Hugo and another run from Georgia at the plate and a single to left. So the Rebels, for just the second time this weekend, have a they can rely on, and Georgia has two. Martina is a solid. It's not fun. And King will get extra bases. That got by Griffin. She's going to dig for three. The throw is not in time. And King with a triple with two outs here in the fifth. If, you, if the ball gets by you, there's no one left. And there's Cully down the right field line. And Cully has an RBI double to score Payne, I should say King. Second and third. And there's a shot backhanded by Hugo. And an RBI ground out for Brown. That plates McDonough. Gets the attention of this broadcast crew. There's a base hit to right by Haley Cully. She's two for three on the afternoon. Cox. Slaps at it. Going to be a tough play by Collins, and Cox beats it out. There's a bouncer to left by Strother. One run will score. And Ole Miss down. They have to be a little more conservative on the. Ole Miss sees something to hang on to. And a base hit up the middle by Schneider. One run will score. Here comes the throw to the plate. And sliding in safely is Morgan. And the Rebels have cut it to two. If Brown can come through, and a one-hopper off the glove of Wilson, and it's a one-run game. Osias lifts one into left center, and we're going to be tied as Osias comes through. Two